Hola. So, absolutely inspired to communicate and explain to people what it is the body code is. So, I'd like to say that I've developed the program, and I know that I have, yet it was absolutely something that has moved through me. Um, I guess it has everything to do with the way I see the human body and spirit. And so let's start there. I believe that you are a soul that has decided to take up space within this human body. And in doing so, the soul must have experiences. Now, some people believe in past incarnations, some people don't. Doesn't really matter if you do or you don't. I believe in past incarnations. However, regardless if you do or you don't, the human structure, the physical form, has the capability of uh, saving uh, data and cellular memory, emotional and psychological um, experiences. So we already know that every single cell in the body has the capability of level of communication because that's what's happening all the time is that the cells in the body are constantly communicating. So if the cells are constantly communicating, why and they're already storing a data, they're already storing a level of information, why wouldn't they store other information, right? So just hypothetically, um, I will say from my own personal experience that that's exactly what it is, but hypothetically, you don't have to 100% believe that, but you know, theory-wise, right? And so if we soul, if we deem the soul a ball of energy, keep it simple, right? This ball of energy, oh, it enters into the physical structure and deals with memory stored within the cells of the human body, right? And just being within the womb, in your basic birthing conception, excuse me, your basic conception experience, you download, uh, you absorb cells of the mother, right? You are co-created by your father and mother. However, you download cells of the mother. Now, with this being said, with this being said, that child starts to take on memories that the mother has stored and not processed. Right? And I can pretty much guarantee that the majority of people watching this video right now have parents, mothers specifically, that have a lot of emotional baggage that wasn't dealt with. And they can see their own patternings show up right? in their day-to-day -day like life and emotional stuff that maybe the mother has unintentionally taught them, but even more so that baby or that human absorbed into their physical cells to which the soul must experience. So why is all of this so important to the body code itself? Because the body code method, um, to which is the system that has been, um, given to me to explain to other people, right? So my own personal journey forced me to either live in my body with harmony or deal with pain, lots and lots of pain and stress. So I had a lot of structural damage uh, starting at birth um, and then I, of course, did my own level of emotional and structural damage throughout my childhood. Um, add on to that even more physical and emotional trauma, you know, in my earlier, you know, gosh, high school, uh, college, 
even after that, all of it, right? And even more so, so many levels of trauma that my physical and structural body have taken on and my emotional body has taken on. And so in order to correct that, um, in order to even walk properly, or even, you know, in order to even walk, uh, and someday I will explain my story in more detail for people so that they have a better understanding of why um, this information has come to me. Um, I've had to learn how to live within my body and deal with the emotional and psychological trauma that was um, caused. So the body code system itself. So... Let's see. There are structural lines within the body. There are energetic grid points within the human body. And these energetic grid points are capable of being um, awakened and, and engaged with um, simply through breath. You can literally, I don't care what state of conditioning you are in, you can access these things simply through breath. I have clients with cerebral palsy uh, that have had very little um, movement as well as uh, ability to even sense, ability to even sense parts of their body that have been capable of awakening parts of their body, now not only having movement but having strength in those parts of their body by utilizing and activating this code with their breath powerful 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 so as the soul enters the body it must deal with cellular memory and information that is stored within the cells and the body code system literally helps you activate all of that right and gain access to the parts of the body that you weren't communicating with prior to right so, I believe that we are these amazing spiritual beings being guided to live and reside within these human structures. However, in order to live within these human structures, one must bring harmony and balance to their body itself. Otherwise, they live in levels of discord and pain living out patterns that they may or may not want to actually participate in. So, what is the body code? The body code system. Well, I lied. I apologize. The body code method. And I should probably kind of put that out there. The body code method was a phrase that I had asked over and over again source to guide me as to what to call this. I said, God, I, I don't I don't know what you want me to call it. I know that I'm I'm doing a very specific kind of work and offering a specific kind of medicine to people, but I don't know a name for it. And I gave God a bunch of options which none of them seemed to resonate at all. Nothing seemed to find that that sweet spot of like, yeah, that's it, that's it, nothing, nothing. And I mean years of asking, years. And um, one day it was given to me. One day the phrase body code method was given to me and so from there I've moved forward with it. Um, I have also been told that there's another system out there. There's somebody, you know, the same name, the body code. Um, I was given the word method, that's to which I use. Uh, however, there is something out there called the body code. I've gone online, I've looked, I don't understand what it is. Um, there's definitely some, I mean, they speak of emotions and energy, uh, but I don't, he, they don't explain what it is. So I really have no idea. And I apologize, there may be a similarity. I wouldn't be surprised. God's brilliant and God wants the medicine to be given to you. So I wouldn't be surprised if it has similarities. It couldn't be the same thing. Um, I doubt the exact same thing because uh, it was delivered to us in our own way, right? So the body code method was delivered to me through my own personal experiences and journey. 
And so I wish to offer to you. Um, it is so powerful. It is so powerful. And what I love the most is it gains access to like levels of freedom. Like your spirit becomes alive and you want to like live even more fully because you are the light. All I'm doing is creating and giving you access to to be even brighter. I am just showing you the pathways to shine even more light into your physical structural body and free you of psychological and emotional scar tissue that has been saturating your cells. That's it. That's it. I give you access to be brighter beings of light. It's awesome. It is so powerful and amazing to witness. I am like so honored to witness it. So, the body code method. <sighs> so cool. It's so cool and I can't wait to share even more of it with you. So, I needed to offer you that information so you have a baseline to where this system goes and why it's been created. Um, I apologize. I had been putting off videos simply because I was told that the camera has been too shaky and I've ordered a... Um, a little tripod so that it would be less shaky and I'm sorry for any shake that this video may have um, done um, forgive my human <laughs> but I message being given is more important than you know all the little details so yeah I um as professional of a being I am if I was to be overly professional, it would lose all the creativity. So, and that would make me really uptight. And we don't want that. We don't want that because then I get like all growly and shit. You know what I mean? Like, so being free to be creative in the moment is so much more powerful for me. And I feel like it's the best gift I can to give to other people. So if I'm not at the level of professional that other YouTubers are at or, um, other people, uh, I'll be honest. I really don't care. You know, watch me. Don't watch me. I don't care. Um, those that watch the information are looking and seeking the medicine and it's the greatest gift I can give them. So, Blessed be, y'all. Blessed be. More to come. Huge hugs. Mm.